still looking at two waves of rain showers and storms to impact our area and it you see it really clearly when you look at this rain map over the next 12 to 14 hours. We've got one peak that comes in after midnight through about the sunrise time frame. We quiet down as we head towards lunchtime and then you see another peak right around two o'clock. So two waves is where most of our rain is going to be concentrated. We do still have some light showers across our southern tier, our southwestern tier right now. A few heavier showers moving into parts of Wayne County. This is the pitter patter of a fairly steady rain. I hope this lulls you into a peaceful night's rest. We will have showers and storms overspreading the area tonight and wind will also be on the increase overnight tonight, but our overall severe threat is low. The area that's identified here, our southern tier is being in a marginal, a level one risk for severe storms tomorrow. That's primarily for the afternoon batch. And the main concern with this would be gusty wind, right? It's going to be windy all day tomorrow. Thunderstorms tend to have even stronger winds than the winds around them. So we may have a few stronger wind gusts. And with the cold front coming through, that cold air is not expected to make it to the surface. But there will be a lot of cold air aloft, and that can help a few hailstones make it down to the ground. This is a look at timing. So overnight tonight, the showers that we have now, they lift north. Once we get past midnight, especially around 1 a.m., that's when we'll have scattered showers and storms come in from the west. This is that first push. This winds down by mid morning. We'll have a break in the action in the mid morning time frame, and then we'll see the actual cold front come through in the afternoon. The showers and storms that come with the cold front tomorrow during the day, it won't be as heavy or as widespread. They'll be much spottier in nature, but they are going to be sort of stubborn and they'll hang around through the Thursday afternoon and evening time frame. Temperatures don't move much, even though it's a cold front. No complaints. Mid 50s overnight, 70 tomorrow. Nice to see the sunshine with some low 70s return on Friday. It's a quick hit of dry weather. Steve showers and storms return as early as midnight. So we head to Saturday morning.